going on, everybody? Mike McFarland, The Lake Fort Guide. Welcome to my studio, um, McFarland's Corner. A little bit of public rundown here for you for Lake Fork. It is November 21st, Tuesday, November 21st. Um, again, welcome to the channel. I'm very, very grateful for you watching. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. It's free. So in this channel here, what we do is we give you a little bit of information about the lake level. We give you some basic fishing reports. And generally, we'll show you and share some good products um, and things like that that uh, we use right here at Lake Fork. So lake level right now, it's actually been stable for the last two days. It's 400.88 above sea level. Um, that is basically about 2.2 feet below full pool. Clarity, zero to one. The last three days, the water has been beautiful. The weather was beautiful. South winds blowing, west-south winds blowing. Um, and the temperatures of the water were really holding in the mid-60s. 63 to 65.4, I think, was the warmest water I saw. Um, but just excellent, excellent fall conditions. Last year, this time of year, we were 12 degrees cooler, and the fish had already shut off. Uh, right now, fishing is excellent if you're in the right area. Um, a lot of the, the fish are being caught shallow on spinnerbaits, crankbaits, uh, underspins, rattle traps, things like that. And you have to be with bait fish. That's the secret about the shallow bite. Really, it's the secret about both bites. Um, there's an awful lot of bait fish in the deeper water, 15 to 18, 20 foot of water, which you could throw spoons on. You can throw Alabama rigs on. You can throw Carolina rigs on, things like that. Um, Honestly, the best bite has been, for me, just shallow working the right sections um, of the lake. We had um, excess of 35 fish in the last two days. Um, it's been really, really good. Lots of, of small, young fish, um, but we had many, many beautiful fish in the four to the biggest was about six and a half pounds. Um, so fishing's really, really picked up here at Fork. And I'm really grateful for that. Um, we're probably going to have some things change with the couple of days cool trend right now. But it's not real bad. Um, it's, it's in the 30s, 35s, and 55s. And it's only a couple days. And then we kind of mildly warm back up for this weekend. Um, so with the parameter that we're in, the temperature-wise, I really think this bite will continue um, for about another week or two. Uh, until this water temperature gets below 55 degrees, we should have some pretty good fishing right here at the world famous Lake Fork. Um, everything's been been uh, just just right for it. So, if you're coming out this weekend, or if you're here now, you know, remember, run shallow, bounce back and forth, shallow deep, shallow deep. If you're not catching them shallow, pull a little deeper, um, and just kind of bounce back and forth, and you put it together. I'll be back every Thursday. We do rundowns Tuesdays and Thursdays. Generally, they upload and they are up for viewing by Wednesdays and Fridays. They're filmed on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Sometimes they upload quickly, but most of the time you're going to be able to see them by Wednesdays and Fridays. So that's what you should expect. And uh, I'm going to show you a bait real quick that I want to share with you. This is a little a larger size bait than I would particularly use right now. Um, but Lake Fork Trophy Lures under new ownership, new management, and has been now for uh, almost a year, um, it's really, really come around and, and they're doing business right. The products are back premium. Um, let's just leave it at that. I'm so grateful to be still aboard and, and part of that mothership of those products, the Lake Fork Trophy Lures, lures with an attitude. Um, and the spoon right here, developed by Kelly Jordan himself. Um, there's a there's three inch, four inch, five inch, and I think, I think this is the five inch. Yeah, I think there's even a six inch. Um, but I can tell you that my side effect on my glasses just broke. Um, I can tell you that this spoon in the fall, this time of year, from now all the way through December, um, in the barfish color, barfish and it doesn't matter what size um, there there is a trick to it being in the right place always location 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 but this particular spoon the flutter spoon used around barfish you got to find the barfish first can catch you 
some giant, giant, giant bass. Um, in November, December, these bass really feed on shad, but they're one of their favorites, the big fish, the eight, nine, 10 pound and greater. They really like to eat the bar fish. So that's just a little public information for you. Lake Fork flutter spoons, three, four, five, and six inch in the bar fish color. Right there, get you some of those. Go online, go up to the store, call it in, whatever, and use the code. I believe it's MCF, MCF10, and you get a discount uh, on, on those baits. Um, other than that, I don't have a lot more to share with you at the moment publicly. Um, but don't be afraid. You're hearing some reports that the fishing is not good on Fork. It is not true. Um, like I said, we just had 35 fish in the last two days of fishing. Also, crappie fishing on Lake Fork is world class. If you want to come out and crappie fish, man, just book a guide. Um, message me and I'll get you hooked up with the right guide. Um, and you will go home with a limit's worth of fish. And there's about five guides that I highly recommend. One in particular that's the very best in my opinion. Um, but really, the top three guides, you're going home with your limit's worth of fish. I, it's just, they never ever fail. Um, they just don't. They work hard, and the lake is just putting out such world-class crappie fishing. It's amazing. 602-826-1524. If you need to, private message me, whatever. Send me a message if you want to do the crappie, and I'll get you dialed in with one of those guys. Um, all right. Other than that, listen, thank you for your subscription. Thank you for watching. Um, I would like to share with you a few things. Lake Fork Marina, um, great support of, of everything we do. Jamie's Restaurant right there in Lake Fork Marina. Awesome food. If you're staying at Lake Fork Marina, uh, be sure to check out the store. Um, and uh, just to you know, go in there and, and say hi to them. Tell them that you saw the show. Tell them you saw Mike McFarland on Lake Fork, the Lake Fork Guide on Le the Lake Fork Guide YouTube. Um, but just remember that you know when you're around the area, that's probably by hands down the most premium operation that we have around the whole entire lake. Uh, there's some great marinas and things, but just first class. That's our first class place to be, Lake Fork Marina. And we're grateful to be coming out of there for sure. All right. If you enjoyed this, hit the like button. Comment below if you have anything to share. And then I will also remind you that I do a members-only channel. Um, and the members-only report is much more detailed. I tell the exact baits, the exact line, the exact presentation, and the exact locations that are best to be fishing on Lake Fort. Um, if you're content with this public rundown, terrific. I'm super grateful. But if you really want the juice, if you really want some more detailed information than ever before, when you finish watching this video, look in the description below and click on Join or Members Only. You'll see the link for Members Only. Just follow the procedures and join the members only channel. And again, I'm looking at all the things right now, these rods that are tied up, the fish, the 35 fish that we just caught the last two days. When I do my members only report here in just a minute, I will tell the members exactly where and precisely how we caught those fish. So thank you so much for watching. I'm Mike McFarland, the Lake Fork Guy.